I'm telling you, this jump shot I'm finna show y'all is crazy. I haven't even maxed out all my shooting badges and I haven't even used my cat breaker. But this jump shot right here is crazy. So hit that like button, subscribe, turn on post notice, and let's get to this banger. Look, I'm not gonna hold y'all. Put your release speed maxed out. And if part of this video where I said don't max it out, look, try how I did it in the video if it worked for you, but I'm telling you right now, just put your release speed maxed out and you're gonna thank me later. Let's get to it. What's good with y'all? It's your boy Too Easy. And as you can tell by the intro of this video, I'm finna give y'all a fire jump shot for my 6-3 build. Now, I spent a little time in the builder to try to figure out what it is to be able to green consistently. What's more important when it comes to the timing of your jump shots? And what I figured out is your jump shot cue, visual cue matters the most. Of course, you still want to have your high ratings. Of course, you still want to have a jump shot that is smooth with no hitches. However, whenever you do find your jump shot, make sure you find the proper visual cue. Now, as you can see, this is the jump shot right here. The jump shot right here, my base is Cameron Thomas. Now, I did try Kyrie Irving, which is cool. I also tried Steve Kerr, which is cool also. But for my preference to how I feel comfortable releasing the square button, because we ain't even going to get on rhythm shooting. It's a cheese if you can get it right. But I base this off of how I feel comfortable with the how this jump shot looks and how I feel comfortable with releasing that square button. And this base is what did it for me. And the next one is Josh Christopher. I don't even know who this is. The second release for my upper is Cameron Thomas. And these are my blends. My release speed is not all the way up i left it in the middle some people are you know doing that i don't know it's it's kind of i might try it later but i ain't trying it right now this right here is doing it for me the blend between josh christopher christopher and cameron thomas is 2872 once again i base this jumper off of how i want to feel when i release the square button and the way i'm able to do that is the visual cue of course you see jump set point push and release and even when you change not these but when you start to change these you see how visual cue changes when you're changing that your visual cues will change and i was in the my court and i was going around i was like man it don't feel like it should be late right here it don't feel like it should be early right here so when i let the button go i was matching this up with where the button when i released the button how i want it to be green and this is what i found most comfortable for me four notches one two three four under push did it for me and when i tell you you can feel the click to this jump shot you can feel it when you you can tell when you let it go early you can tell when you let it go late for the most part but when you hit the green it feels good because you just feel the click and like i said i'm gonna show you some clips of me in a wreck i haven't been to the park yet because i ain't got a squad i'm still leveling leveling up my my player i'm gonna put some clips together to show you that i'll be greening consistent contested it really don't matter so this is the jump shot six three I have an A plus release height. I have a release B A plus defensive immunity B timing stability B minus. I might try this. Not that I'm tripping. I might try this just to see, you know, but this is what I'm rocking with right now. So let me know how y'all feel. Let me know what you think. And let me know if you were aware of Cameron Thomas as a base, but this is the one, this is the one, this is the one. Hit that like button, subscribe, turn on post notice, and follow your boy on Twitch, man. I'm going live. Look out for my lives on YouTube. And we back in here, man. Content, TikTok, all that, man. I appreciate y'all, and I'm going to see you in the next one. Peace.